Hey guys, what's up? Let me get out of this room. She gave me a bloody nose. She bit inside my nose like right there. I think it's full of blood. Nail. It has blood on it. Great. Hey, yo. Oh, yo. Okay, so right now, I was just watching a video of my friend's personal best freshwater fish. Now, his personal best saltwater fish is a 10 and a half pound bonita. It was 10 7. It was a big old bonita. And they, were, they fit it to a goliath by accident. They just tossed it in, and my friend didn't know that there was goliaths under him. He didn't chum at all or anything. And a guy jumped up and ate it. They're fishing for a marlin. But Goliath got it. Goliaths are the biggest, um, whatever. They are the biggest fish in the world. The biggest mammal is a whale. Now, Goliath groupers, if they're big enough, they could eat a whale. A whale, like a full grown blue whale. And my best friend, he said he caught a six, an 800 pound Goliath. I said, There's no way. He showed me video footage. I don't know how to roll clips or something from that. Yeah. But, uh, I'll tell you, it was a big lion, big boy. It was with Blackdiff H Fishing or whatever the channel's called. And uh, yeah. So my personal best, this, I don't know what this video is about. I just haven't uploaded so just wanted to talk about some things. My personal best ever fish was a 10, this is my biggest catfish, I think. Yeah. I think it was seven pounds. It was a good, big old catfish. Big catfish. Almost as big as a spike wheel. That way. Bigger than the spike wheel. And then it's a big bike wheel. It's like. I don't know how big. But, uh, yeah. My personal best bass. Bass fishing is a. It's a priority for me. Or whatever the word would be. Or something. Bass fishing is just the thing that I do all the time. I'm more than lucky to know how to catch bass. More than lucky. And uh, someone he was using a bait caster. And he accidentally, he was really good at using one because he started off with one. He threw it right under a branch, got snagged on something. And when he got snagged, it turns out he got snagged on my old fishing line for like a year ago when I had a whopper plopper. And he caught my whopper plopper. It was in perfect condition. Nothing happened to it because it was just in the tree branch. It was brand new and that was the second cast and got stuck right under it. This was at a different old pond at our old house. So it had been for like three and a half close to maybe four years we rented it but uh it sucked they're on a big boy house big ass house now the reason i started cussing i realized what's the point it, older people are not watching my videos There was a 14 year old watching one of my videos. And uh, yeah, he said, are you filming on a GoPro? Uh, I'd, I didn't know if he had a YouTube channel or I didn't look anything up. Cause it, it would just be too much work. So.
I just scroll down, scroll down on something. I got some tadpoles. I'm not sure you guys can see, but got hundreds. I have to check this footage. Yeah, these things are amazing bait. And I'm gonna use them for bluegill. So, oh, when the, there's also tons of frogs, and I use the for. I went, I went frog hunting with a whole child, and uh, yeah, got a bit. He caught a big toad, and surprisingly, he was more brave than I was catching them. I had to grab them by the side and put my finger on the skull and everything. Slightly, it's not too hard to catch frogs, but he's not a big uh, animal lover. I mean, I love fish. There's I've eaten fish, but catch them, I love them. I, fish is a nice thing. Is he not? Go potty, baby. Go potty. So, yeah. See ya.